Boogie drop that beat. Hi everyone, welcome to my channel, Talking Out Loud with Miss Talking. If everything I say is my own opinion, alleged, and strictly entertainment purposes, remember, I'm just talking out loud. Please like, share, subscribe. Comment on the video, let me know what you think. Now, Wanda did a live and she was, you know, basically just giving um, birthday shout outs to herself and, you know, people that she know of that are... Um, Leo's and have birthdays coming up and that she's going to miss because she's on her way to Germany and Paris and um, other places and she's going to be gone um, about maybe three weeks or so. She doesn't know. She really didn't stay. But one thing that I picked up on is that she said, well, first off, she was, uh, I'm like, well, how many times have she been married? Because she was giving someone a shout out and she was like to my, um, I can't think if it was their sister or cousin or somebody, but she said on my first husband's side and I'm like, well, dang, how many times you been married? So what number of husband are you on, Wanda? And second, um, she was talking about her truck. She said that, well, I'm gonna let you hear what she had to say and about her truck. And I'm going to come back and give my opinion. Yeah, Leo season is going to be over. So then it'll be my time to get ready for my truck action. I will be getting ready for my truck action. So y'all know that I'll be focused on my truck. I've been focused on this on this trip right here for the last past four months, four or five months, y'all. So, hey, it is what it is. The day have came. So I want to get a shot. So... I'm like, it's the, okay, if you said when you get back, that's when you'll be focused on your truck action. So are you saying, are you telling us this, that the truck still isn't ready? Because in your lives, you keep saying that the truck is ready. Um, And you're, when you go live on YouTube, you keep hollering about the truck is ready. You just ain't ready to bring it out. But now you say that you did not um uh bring the truck out because you've been focused more so on the tr um the trip for your birthday versus being on the um you know spending your time messing with the truck and i understand if that's the case because sometimes we don't have the funds that we need and if we you know uh we have to allocate them to you know what's primary to us at that time so she probably was like okay i got this trip to plan for i'm going all these places i need to save money and i can understand that except for the fact that she been screaming that the truck is ready ready to go and um she don't you know it's just sitting outside all she got to do is get in it and go even so I'm like, well, if that's the case, you know, everybody's been wondering, you know, been waiting to see this, you know, look, uh, concoction that she didn't threw together for this truck because this should be a bomb ass truck that she didn't, um, put together or pay for by now because she's been talking about this truck for a while now. And the truck that we seen on the show, don't know if that's the truck she bought or that uh, Tisha had to chip in and help her pay for, allegedly. I don't know. But um, the truck that she showed, that they showed on the show, that truck would have still been sitting there. And as long as it's taken for this truck to... um come to fruition or whatever she may as well had a um went on ahead and bought a brand new truck at least um a up-to-date truck messing with that thing 
because I don't, I think that truck was just an abandoned shell. That's what it looked like to me. I don't know. Maybe looks can be deceiving, but I didn't see her start that truck up. I didn't see that. I didn't see her go behind that wheel and crank that bad baby up. And I, because I can't see nobody eating no food about cooked up in that truck. So it was going to take a miracle and a prayer to get that truck up and running. So maybe she had to put it to the side so she could pay for this birthday trip of hers. And now um, when she, whenever she gets back from the birthday trip, that's when she's going to fully put her energy into getting the truck up and running. But my thing is, if it's not running... If it's not ready, then what? why did you tell us that the truck was ready if it wasn't? Because if you couldn't, if you had other things to do or other priorities, that's fine. But don't st don't tell us no um no stories and feel as though oh it's you know it's like oh it's okay it's okay mm 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 just straight up in my opinion. You told a fib. You, you straight up lied. That's just my opinion. I'm just talking out loud. Please like, share, subscribe. Comment on the video. Let me know what you think.